Guys and welcome back to another video of Spark Plug. So in this video tutorial, I will show you how to make the use of parameters or the parametric design concept in Fusion 360. For those of you who don't know what parametric design or what the parameters means in 3D modeling, let me just show you with a quick example. So let's first go to a sketch. Uh, I will simply create a rectangle by pressing R, press D for dimension, give this dimension suppose there as 200. And we don't have to give this dimension. Let, let it be like this only. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to relate this dimension, the 201, with this 93 one. So when I, whenever I will change this dimension, the this one will automatically get changed as per the parameter I have assigned to it. For example, let me just double click on it. What I'm going to do is first of all I'm going to assign any alphabet that will represent this alphabet or any word or any uh, uh, anything you want so for, suppose that a is equal to 200 uh, I'm I am I have assigned an alphabet named a uh, with the 200 and then you, you can just press ok now what I'm going to what I want this dimension to be exactly half of this dimension a so what I'm going to do is just double click on it erase all the things just press a and if you want half press slash for divide and press 2 and you may press enter you can see its effect the fx is the sign of function so it represents that this dimension is the function of this one and the function represents is this it this dimension is exactly the half of this one you can uh, choose any parametric formulas division multiplication addition anything you want suppose that uh, a plus 10 so this will automatically be uh, 210 suppose that i make it 300 this will automatically be 310 so for now let it be divided by 2 and 200 if i just make it 500 you can see that it, it will automatically be uh, 250 now finish the sketch now <clears throat> the parametric design not only works on soil uh, sketch workspace but also on the solid workspace let me just quick review give you a quick review suppose that i want this to be extrude and Remember that, that we have given that length A as the master dimension. So what I'm going to do is, is the distance A, what I'm going to do is, so if I just make this A and press enter, it will automatically extrude the distance as similar as the A. And if you want it to be multiplied, you can multiply it by 2.5 like this. I want uh, this extrude distance would be A multiplied by 2.5 and like this. Now, if I just go back to workspace and let's just change it to 1000 and finish this sketch, you can see that it, it automatically changed the dimension. And if I just measure the point from here to here, From this point to this point, it's exactly 205, uh, 2500, which is exactly uh, 2.5 times of 1000. So this is how the parametric design works in Fusion 360. Hope you guys will enjoy the video. Please comment any queries and suggestions in the uh, comment section below. And don't forget to share and subscribe my channel.